It's the end of the boating season, so I decided to replace my gas-powered truck with the F-150 Lightning for a day to see if it could actually tow the boat home without running out of battery. Let's see if Larry figures out which car it is. We have a hybrid F-150 here. We have the Lightning here, and we have a gas one over there. Larry, come here! All right, okay, now you have more space. You can extend your blanket out this way. There you go. F-150 is charged to 100%. 289 miles of range, 100% battery, and I have to go pick up the trailer first, then drive to Arrowhead, which is about 70 miles away, and then pull the boat out of the lake. So I should be able to line this up exactly with the hitch with that black line. Oh. Like that. Okay. And then I put the safety pin in here. Let's see if I can get this to clip. There we go. Headlight switch. There we go, so headlights are on. Now the uh, side lights come on. Just gonna make sure all of those are on. All of our lights are working. Everything is good. I did just go over this, so I think obviously it should work, but it's always good to check. All right, so that's it. Sit. Remy, sit. Sit. Oh, Larry got your treat. Remy, gotta be faster. Gotta be faster. Hey, you almost took my hand off. You press this button two times. Gives you a little warning, and then it closes. The trailer is all secured, all the lights work. So it's good to go. That's exactly what we want. Now we have enough room to get out, and we're gonna get on the road. Looks like we have 100%, 283 miles of range. That is pretty neat that I can see the trailer in the back like that. I think the empty trailer is what, 1,500 pounds or something. Confirm. Boat trailer empty is active. Okay, so we have that set up. I have 150 miles of range now. We have 70 miles to go, so that should be fine. We want more AC for the dog. That's good. So what we're gonna do is periodically check in and I will update you on the range like once we get on the freeway and start going up the mountain etc I'm on the highway now and the range went up to 200 miles and I have 95% of the battery left and we've already gone 10 miles so so far so good Arrowhead is only about 60 miles away about to get off the highway and head up the mountain. And the dog is pleased. We're just gonna go out wide, let this guy pass, and then come through. No one's in there, didn't hit anybody, that's good. All right, so we're gonna head up the 18 now, and it's going to be a test of the battery. We're going up and we have a beautiful view out there. The range is not going down as fast as I've experienced in other electric cars, which is very interesting because we do have a trailer on the back. So I'm honestly pretty impressed right now. And we'll get an elevation sign here to see how far we've climbed. I think we're coming up on 3,000 feet and we're only going to 5,000 feet. So, I mean, things are looking really good for this truck. The most impressive thing about this is that I can't even feel the weight of the trailer. The, the throttle response is instant because it's an electric motor. It's just phenomenal compared to 
gasoline powered truck or a diesel powered truck, this for, for workloads is actually a better power plant if you can deal with the range limit. All right, we are at 126 miles of range left and we have gone 60.6 .6 miles. So the range is going down as I go up the mountain. We have 62% battery. Overall, pretty good. All right, so we made it to the top. We're descending now into Arrowhead. We're at 58% battery, 117 miles left on the range, and our trip was only 65 miles. So the question is, would that get us home? It just went up to 59. Will that get us home with the boat on the back? Yeah, so 58% after towing this trailer up the mountain is pretty impressive. I don't think I need to plug the truck in at all. This is the best tow vehicle because there's no hesitation. It just instantly pulls the boat out of the water and you can just put incremental amounts of throttle. It's very easy to control. So the weight is a little bit over 5,000, but I don't think I can go there. So we're gonna do 5,000 pounds. Next, confirm. And now my range dropped. I have only an 80 mile range. This is going to be very, very close. Wow. All right, so and I'm also going down to the lake to do a drone shot before I leave, which isn't the smartest move, but that's what we're gonna do. What I noticed right away towing this boat is how smooth it is. I can't even tell there's a trailer on it. It's really impressive. So we are just getting out of Arrowhead now. I have to go up a little bit in order to get to the main road before we go down. And we're at 53% battery, 77 miles range. We've only gone two and a half miles, but you can see there that each mile is eating up one kilowatt hour in the battery pack. And so that is not the best but it's because this trailer is pretty heavy and we are going uphill. So you can see that mileage range is just, is just going down. Out on the main road now, 72 mile range, 51% battery. I've only traveled 3.8 miles, so not looking good. The range keeps dropping, uh, but it's probably just correcting for how much power we're using. And I think that's because we're climbing out. We're gonna start our descent now and see if we can charge up the battery. Uh, we're going down there, 5,000 foot elevation change, so that should charge the battery, but who knows. Looks like we're only going to get to 57%. We're coming to the bottom of the mountain now, and my range went up from 70 miles to 102, and if I go to the car play here and I look at my map to see how long it's going to take to get home, destinations that's the wrong address but it's okay it's close enough I'm gonna skip the toll road so I'm gonna go a different route that's a little bit longer but only 50 miles so with the 102 mile range I should be fine to make this getting off the freeway now and 32% battery, 54 miles of range left. I think I have about 10 miles or so left to go. So this is pretty good. 
One of the most notable things about the electric truck is how well it accelerates even with this 5,000 pound trailer on the back. It, it just gets off the line very quick and it's very smooth. So if I floor it right now, I'm towing a trailer up the hill. That is insane. I'm gonna go back and go slow. I don't wanna waste the battery. It probably burned a whole percentage of battery there but just a huge amount of torque in this thing. Super easy to tow the boat with. And when I was pulling it out of the water, it was so smooth. It's a really great tow rig for towing the boat, actually. The dog is ready to get out of the car. He's had enough. All right, let's... Uh bring it on down the driveway oh my gosh okay I think I made it barely 26% we're no longer towing the boat we're going back home I have 24% battery 40 miles of range so yeah overall the tow was a success and this truck did much better than I expected that is all I have for you on the Ford F-150 Lightning towing test. Thank you all for watching and make sure that you enjoy your car.